We are now officially going to be watching Pixar's latest movie. I've been a bit of a Pixar critic in the last few months. Wasn't a big fan of Soul's ending. Wasn't a crazy fan of Luca. Monsters at Work's first episode bored me, but I think that's the kind of general consensus. And I really disliked Onwards. Will turning red turn me around? We will find out. Let's go give it a look. All right, guys. <laughs> what a first impression. We've got goopy slime monsters, apparently. Only my premiere does this, and only whenever I put in something I've downloaded. Maybe it's right. the way I've, I, my downloading yeah. works, because I've just got a building with eyes right now. I'm a bad trailer reactor. Quadratic formula. They've gone for a... a I've noticed... I, so I've seen a few things about this trailer in different takes, because, obviously, I was getting notifications on Twitter. Um, people saying that they really like how Pixar is leaning into unique human designs that are all kind of distinct. Luca had a very specific human design that was its own style. I can see that, again, going on here, which is quite cool. Also, this is strange. This is clearly like a winter autumn movie, but we're getting the trailer in July. Strange. And I bet it's thematic to autumn because they turn red like leaves. Wow. Or not. Your mom is outside. That's not how you spell your. What a disaster. My friend has poor grammatical choices in their life. I would feel the same. Oh god. No. 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 This isn't happening. <laughs> that is a very this is a a very dodgy parenting technique that wouldn't really fly well in the, you know, in real life. I gotta admit. What is that? Oh Settle down, little goblins. Settle down, little goblins. This teacher is essentially me. <laughs> so what, she's got a really crazy over the top mom? I don't... Alright. Sorry, it's, 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 it's a shame because it's a slow paced scene. <laughs> yeah. Did you see that, by the way? <laughs> My artifacting, I think just spoiling trailers for myself at this point. This is a very strange concept. Oh well. No, it was just a delivery. It's throwing me off, I think. So she's basically like Cyclops from X-Men, but you know, a giant red panda thing. All right. Is this, are these connected? Does, okay. Like, why Why is the mum being so weird, but then also surprised? Because at first I thought it was going to be like a, she's some sort of scientist connection there. But I guess it's a metaphor for emotions. This is odd, yeah? Right, I feel like, I, like I'm like, am I overreacting to like a pretty standard concept? Or is that like, this, del why? What's going on? What's the point? How did this not, how, is this a surprise? Is this the first time? Why? I got a lot of questions. Also, is that, if you'd stop artifacting, no, okay, it's not Toy Story Clouds, that's all I wanted to know. <laughs> Wait, was that it? Oh no, that's it. Okay, Canada, Toronto, I learnt it. Got it on there. Uh, it might not be her mum. Yeah, but then if it was not her mum, I was thinking that, right? Like, it's a scientist or something. Like, you know, some FBI agent or something. Why was she surprised to see that, uh, you know? If it was, if she wasn't surprised, then that'd be like, oh, I see. She's like hunting for her. You know, she's trying to, you know, take her away or something. But I really thought there were going to be a lot more answers in this. Like, is that, is she, okay, she's just got like an emotions problem with a, with a, to be fair. Wait, it, she does say it's mummy. Tell him it's mummy. Okay, so maybe it's not. But then, like, why, why is she here just to make 
as an inciting incident to make her go crazy? Why is she so bright? What? Why is this happening? Was this the first time? What? This sounds like it, maybe it's just super simple. I'm thinking about it too hard. If she controls her emotions, she doesn't become the thing. Anything else? No, no. Man, I saw another comment about this that basically said, we're going to have to accept the discussion that Pixar movies are just getting boring. Like, Luca was kind of standard. It was simple. Does kind of look like this is going in the same direction. Am I right on that? Maybe I'm overthinking this. You know what I mean? I have a high expectation for Pixar. This is just seems like a... Has this been done before? I feel like this is like something that happens in like a... This is a TV episode's plot line. Which is what I also kind of thought of Luca. Luca was like a Pixar short extended to a film. This feels like a Pixar short extended into a film. I don't mean to be a Pixar critic. But that's what I'm seeing right now, you know? I guess it's a, you know, it's a coming of age story of like... A young girl learning to control her emotions and become a well-rounded normal person. You know what I mean? Something about this just doesn't have any Pixar magic. It just feels like a plot line so far. But to be fair, this is a minute and a half long. You know? She did get delivered. There, there's the mum, right? Just driving past. I don't know. Like, Because... <laughs> Or it is just she's got a super over over overprotective mom that's making her emotional, completely separate. Didn't know about the panda raccoon thing. You know? I don't know. Feels very Incredibles Hulk esque with the whole emotions turns person into this. Yeah. That is very much yeah, the pinnacle this has been done before. Yeah. Yeah, I really thought there would be more to that. It like uh, this trailer told me nothing new, essentially. I, I could have learned all of this from the poster. It's the basic premise. It's a teaser. Whatever. It's going to have an uphill battle to impress me.